Hey, welcome to the first episode of Mars Museums. I'm so excited! Yay! Okay, today is the first episode of Mars Museums. We are headed to Brooklyn. We're going to the Brooklyn Museum to look at some really good African American art and some black movement art because black movement art is very important and it's, oh, it's always good to support black artists. So we're going to head to Brooklyn Museum in Brooklyn. We're going to get on the train. So let's go, people. Here we go. Okay, we are walking to the train station. We are taking the two or the three to oh, the Brooklyn Museum. I'm very excited about sure. this. I'm glad we had a good day to do this because yesterday was, it was seriously snowing and I'm glad not today. And it's a little warmer, so it's a good thing. Um, yep, it's a good day. It's sunny as you can see. <laughs> it's very sunny. It's good. So, very excited. Welcome to the train. Um, yeah, so let's go to the train. I'm gonna, I may not film the troll train ride because it's gonna be a very long train ride for me, like 30 minutes. But when we get there, because I'm excited about to see this, it's wonderful. But we see him, here we come! Woohoo! We're here in front of the Brooklyn Museum. That's the museum behind me. You see they're building extra to the building, so that's new construction. But we're here, we're about to go inside, so let's go! Okay, let's go inside. Let's go check in and admit ourselves, get some tickets. Here we go. Tickets? Okay, I actually checked in with you. Now we're gonna go ticket. Let me show you my ticket. A little arm tickets, isn't that cool? A little Q code on it. I got some reading material to read about here. And guess what? This museum was only three dollars for admission. <laughs> I had to pay the sixteen dollars, which is wonderful. Okay, we're on the fifth floor now, and we're gonna see the Canoe Willy New Republic of Exhibit. Here we go. Inside we go. So here's something about the artist and exhibit. There's a lot to read, but I'm not gonna read it. I'll find it online and post it in the comment section of this video. So let's see. So let's go to the side and see. Here we go. See. Look at that. That's awesome. Is that stained glass? Yes, that is. It is stained glass paintings. See, this artist creates. African American arts, or the African American people, but with a European feel to it. So it looks like like he could be a Jesus figure, but he's not. I see he goes all the way around. So here's another one. Look at that. That is awesome. It looks like people you see every day, but they're put in the position of like they're Catholic or Roman Catholic European style figures. This is great. This is kind of, he's kind of showing that like, the, during that time, African American art was not a big, it was not very popular in the world, and and uh, European art was, so he's kind of reflecting with that kind of style and movement in that time period as well. But it's great, look at this, it goes all the way around. I love this. It's, it's like a little Catholic temple of black people. Let's, let's see what else there is, let's see, let's more. Here's another one. That's awesome. Look at that. Look at that. That's so cool. What's over here? Let's see. Excuse me, lady. Let's see. Oh, there's more. See, these are more like smaller figures framed. Same, same technique, same style. You see, I seem to like to focus on men, black men. This is good. This is great. Of these, they're so different, unique looking, and the painting strip painting unique is is wonderful. I love it. These are great. These are so good. Okay, there's more work over here from the exhibit. These are largely paintings. Seem like oh, that's great. Look at that. It's odd, but good. Let's see what's over here. See, this is very unexpected. Like I would expect. An urban boy be laying in the flowers and sheets like that, but it's it's wonderful and just very large paintings. This artist is great. Look, look at that. That's awesome. These are all really good. Look at that one. Wow. I 
I love these. They're so different and unique looking. Like, they're not expected. Like, you want to expect these things to be. What's over here? Let's see. What's this? It's a horse. Like, let's see. Let's see. What? Is that Michael Jack? Is that Michael Jackson? Yes, that is. And a horse. Wow. You see, even new celebrities. That's Michael Jackson. Yes, that is. Okay. Yep. Michael Jackson. Wow. Okay. Let's see what else is there. Another, another horse. Yeah. Let's see. That. It's so unique. And look at that. It's so pretty. And bold and bright. The colors are so, and the paint strokes are made. There's not even like a stretch. It's perfect. I love the colors. It's so different. It's like, you should, it's, this is so different. It seems like the two things don't go together, but they do. This is great. I love these. I love them. It's really good. Wow. Wow. That's really good. This is amazing. Look at that. Look at the detail in his hair. That is awesome. That is so good. Look at that. Look at his hair. It's so, even though it's paint, it looks from afar, it doesn't look like paint. But it is. Yes, he was over here. See, another good one, another one, these are really good, oh, he looks African, yeah, he's African, and, uh, and him too, that's great, he's awesome, his skin color is gorgeous. These are so good. Look at that. Awesome. It's beautiful. That is beautiful. Awesome. So good. So good. I love these. Yeah. I think these are part of a series that he put together. So these all belong to one series of group paintings he did. Look at that. That is great. This is massive, though. This is so big. Look at that. But it's so well created. This is awesome. I love it. So good. Awesome. Love it. This is so cool, look at that. Let's see. Another, more Africans. These are great. Oh, their skin is beautiful. Okay, let's go to another part of the museum and see what's in here. Let's see, let's see what's in here. Ow. This is crazy. Look at that. What is that? Let's see, it looks, it was that burned? Let's see, well, it doesn't, it, 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 let's see, paper, glue, glue, medium canvas, burn, uh, and wood is burnt. Wow, interesting. Huh. Look at that, that's, it's cool looking though. Look at that, and there's the breeze. Wow. Huh, okay. Wow, that's amazing. It reminds me of rain. Like a rain falling. That's cool. This is so good. It's good. Let's see. I think, okay, I think we're getting the furniture over here. Because it's more like 18th century, 19th century furniture. It seems like it. Let's see. The, the vintage, vintage furniture. Look at the little teapot. That's so cute. 
one. Let's see. This is the smooth pillow plate. Look at that. You see, T Blossom 1840. Let's see. Look at the spoon. That is too cute. Let's see. A little ladle spoon. 1800s. Wow. Look at the table. It's so vintage. But look at that. That's amazing. Look at that. Wow, it's someone's home. It's someone's home. It's someone's home. That is so cool. Look at that mirror. That is so cool. That's amazing. It is so good. And look at the detail and everything on it. Oh, a door. Let's do what it belong to. Let's see who that belongs belong to. So, must be someone's house. Let's see, this door belongs to... This a house here in New York City. It belonged to... and belonged to Dutch in 1836. Huh. You would sell someone's home. Interesting. This would be furniture that belongs in the house. This is a sofa. You see house. Huh. 1830s so far. Let's see. It doesn't. Yeah, that must stuff be up in someone's house. Oh, this is amazing. Look at that. Oh, I want that in my house. That is so cool. That is so awesome. Let's see, where's this from? 1750. It's one on cherry. And belong to New York City home. And belong to Dutch settlers. That is awesome. I want to touch it, but I can't open it. That is so cool. When our trip to the Book Museum is over, I had a good time. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you enjoyed seeing the art. We're on my back home to Manhattan. And we've been editing. This video should be up by this evening. So look out for it. And I'll see you in our next Mars Museum episode or next Friday. See you next time. Bye.